Howdy, and welcome to another Kevin Miller unidirectional video chat. I apologize for the long hiatus of uh, what I had attempted to make the cancellation of these video chats has turned into simply a hiatus, mainly because the fans have demanded it. I didn't think anybody cared, and I keep getting subscription hits, and people will keep asking me for more, so... Uh, here we are with uh, the Kevin Miller unidirectional chat number six, answering your questions and chatting with you in a unidirectional way. Well, a little while ago, somebody asked me uh, uh, if I was a Christian because I referenced the greatest selling book of all time from the greatest story of all time, the Bible. And the answer is yes. Yes, I am a Christian. In fact, my day job, uh, this does not make me more Christian-y, it just is a fun fact. Uh, my day job, I work at a church in Hollywood. You can find us at churchinhollywood.com. There I am the director of hospitality, and I have been employed by Ecclesia, that's the name of our church, for the past seven years, uh, doing all sorts of jobs. Uh, as the church has grown, so has my job grown with it. And currently, I am in charge of making us the most hospitable place on the planet. And I enjoy doing it. I get to work with some pretty cool volunteers, and we get to meet in a pretty cool location. And uh, it's pretty cool all around. Um, this is my office. It's here at the corner of Wilcox and uh, Hollywood Boulevard in Hollywood, California. Uh, I live about six miles from here in North Hollywood, which is where most of our videos have been shot before this. But I thought it'd be cool if you saw a little bit of what was going on in my office corner here. Yes, I have some Star Wars paraphernalia. Uh, and I also have uh, the corner office, which looks out onto the street and the hillsides above. Or out? It looks out. The window looks out. And it is there that you see the Hollywood sign. Yes, over there in the corner. Uh, my, our offices are currently, for, the la for a couple more weeks until about mid-September, here in the Pacific Theater. We used to have our services in the theater space down below, uh, but now uh, we've lost our lease and they are doing something different with the building. So um, that is the part of the building because we are on the fourth story here behind the chain link pigeon proof fence that is our window. Um, but we have our offices in the building until mid-September, and we meet at another church's location on Sundays just down the road. But this is a pretty decent view, I think I have. I think you would agree. Uh, this is an old sign that I designed, and uh, I like to keep my office pretty friendly, so I fill it with fun toys and fun things to look at. And the prize of my collection of things to look at is this. My mini micro machine wall. These were toys uh, that were out in the 80s when I was a kid, and I had the complete set because I'm awesome like that. My parents are even more awesome like that. So, as an adult, I didn't want to let them sit in a box and be all alone and quiet and sad like in the movies Toy Story. So, I attached them to each other and hung them on the wall, and they become art. And I get a lot of compliments from people for what I have done. And, fun fact it's not just pleasing to the eye, it's also a working city. You can drive all around it. There are no dead ends. I'm very pleased. Very pleased with that. Little fun fact. And over here is uh, where I keep uh, some movies, and sometimes I put a movie on and quietly watch it when no one's looking. <laughs> but they know. They know all the same. And this is our verse for the year uh, that we are keeping in front of us as we continue to work uh, at the church in Hollywood. You are the light of the world. A town built on a hill cannot be hidden. Neither do people light a lamp and put it under a bowl. Instead, they put it on the stand, and it gives light to everyone in the house. In the same way, let your light shine before others, that they may see the good deeds and glorify your Father in heaven. And that is what these unidirectional chats are intended to be, a light beaming to you through the magic that is the Internet. Uh, another question that I got through the unidirectional video chat comments, which you may leave yours down below, you know the drill, uh, is that I, I got a little flamage for saying that Sly was adopted. Um, that was a slip of the tongue. I think we all know that Sly was orphaned and never adopted. Uh, please do not flame me when I make a slip of the tongue. Flamers, be flamed. Um, let me know what you want to know about Sly or about the Kevin Miller or about the Gamerland podcast or any of the fun things going on. I am at your disposal and we're back from inner space. Uh, this is the Kevin Miller saying, okay, bye.